Hey, I'm Siobia Rivers. I am a personal trainer, group fitness instructor, but I, I like to think of myself as a life coach. Uh, I've been doing this about five years now. Um, I have a major in exercise science and I'm just here ready to play with Jackie the Beast. So let's do it. Thanks for tuning in to BeastAtPlay.com for another episode of 101 Ways to Play. I am so excited that Siobia has welcomed me to her playground. Let's start with your fitness and um, health background. What introduced you? Okay, um, so I've been an athlete my whole life. Um, I've been active my whole life, playing at the park, playing with my brothers, playing yeah. outside, double dutch, playing it, playing ding dong ditch. So like I've always been an active child and I think that's where it started my childhood. And nice. then in high school, playing volleyball, softball, um, in college, continuing playing um, volleyball. So I've just, and then also like when I was in college, I started doing personal training and group fitness. And I mean, it's just really stuck, stuck with, with me. You. Yeah. Gotcha. So for you, what was that thing that motivated you to maintain? What is the thing that keeps you going that um, in your discipline? Um, well, so I'm an encourager. And um, my thing is I love to encourage others to live that healthy lifestyle and to, to be, I don't know, the but, best them possible. Yeah, or like just, I, I like to encourage people to do the positive things that I do. Right. And I think that's what keeps me in it. And also just knowing all the health benefits and I want to live long. Um, and I want others to live long too. And I want people to feel good. I want to feel good. So I want to just radiate that energy to everybody. Definitely. So for someone who's always maintained a healthy lifestyle, there's people asking right now like, well, she's always been fit. I can't do what she does. What are some of the misconceptions of maintaining or adopting an healthy lifestyle? So people think that they have to work out crazy. Like I have to work out seven days a week and like right. five days a week and I have to go hardcore. No, like you just need to get moving and you need to find out what movement is fun for you. Definitely. You know, it only takes about 30 minutes a day to work out to get those basic health benefits but exactly. I say like if you want your abs to pop out now then you're gonna have to do more right you're gonna have to eat better and like people also think with diet they think that they have to cut out everything bad I still eat bad I sometimes eat. like come on I love my wings I love my burgers I love my fries like I love my donuts so it's just all about balance nice. you can't be eating donuts every day right you can't be eating uh fried chicken wings heroes or whatever every day I mean breakfast is important it is the most important meal of the day, and that's the most get meal of the day, I mm -hmm. um, And I tell them breakfast is important. So um, definitely starting off, um, boosting that metabolism with just hot water and lemon, or if you want to do green tea and lemon, that's perfect. And also starting your morning off with a smoothie, add something green into it. Um, you know, you don't want too many uh, fruits, because right. it's packed with a lot of sugar. Right. Right, so you want to add something green into it. So spinach, kale, um, you can even do um, romaine lettuce. So um, that's important. Breakfast is very important for me. So and before you move on, what are some of the benefits um, of, like you already said, uh, speeding up your metabolism, but what are some of the benefits of adding in your greens and your smoothies or having uh, jump starting the, your morning with water or the hot water with lemon or um, so, teas? So um, it's also going to give you energy for the day. Mm -hmm. If you don't have anything, if you don't fuel your body with anything, you won't have anything. Or if you fuel your body with the wrong things, you won't be able to survive the, the day. Right. So that lemon water is going to help energize you as well. So are those green leafy vegetables. Um, it's also going to aid with having a glowing, you know, a glowing... My melanin yeah, popping. It's popping. Yeah, okay. glowing skin. Um, and also just helping with digestion and um, clear, clearing out your system. You know, eating those green leafy vegetables helps to get all that right. shit out. You know? Literally, so, right. You, you, you need to clear your system. So what are some healthy alternatives for you um, with your cravings? So, you know, I like the Froyo. I mean, I like gelato, I like ice cream, and a healthy alternative for that is Froyo, frozen yogurt. Definitely. Um, you go to frozen yogurt places, they usually have healthy topping options with fruit. Um, you have to have self-discipline, of course, because they have the marshmallows, the chocolate. The drizzle. Uh, yeah, all of that. Y'all, you stressed. So, <laughs> and, and like a little bit of that is fine too. So, um, but yeah, Froyo is my go-to. Um, also, I've been trying out vegan milkshakes, or not even, you can't even call them milkshakes since there's no milk in it, but. Vegan shakes. Vegan shakes, they're amazing. Nice. Uh, they're amazing. And they, it just tastes so pure. So that's like what I. feels bad. Isn't it crazy how you find out like, okay, I found that when I cook with fresh ingredients, 
more flavor comes out. Yes. Mm-hmm. I'm like, why? It's yeah. all of it's like a great wine. It's like all of these flavors are unfolding because I use the natural flavors yeah. and ingredients versus like all of like the processed, you know, salts and sugars and spices yeah. or whatever. You know, like the case those may be. bagged rices that people just add water to. Oh, you know? cause that's so so fun. And it's so easy, but you know, if you make it like you said naturally or just organically, it's gonna taste way better. Those flavors definitely, are gonna pop. Definitely. What are some of the things that people should be cognitive of in their day to day to show them how to maintain and um, adopt healthy lifestyles? Uh, you want to be cognitive about your schedule and be realistic with yourself. Like people make these unrealistic goals and say, hey, I'm going to go to the gym five days a week. Well, no, your schedule doesn't even allow that. Right. So just being realistic, you know, thinking about what you like to do, like make it fun. Like I said, make it fun. Right. And um, make it work for you. What may work for somebody else it may not work for you Definitely. like for me i'm not a big runner i don't like to run miles at a time you know i stick with my warm-up one mile okay. you know or i won't even run them out i'll do jump rope you know i'll rollerblade i ride yeah. my bike so it's, it's just different ways you gotta you gotta um really find out what works for you so what would be your go-to training style what's your like oh yes this puts me in my element my go-to um i love dancing and i just love like vibing out some music like i'll turn on some music and i'll just start moving yeah and it just kind of comes organically what um as far as your training programs what can people come to expect from you and what do you have coming in the future um they can just expect different just expect innovation and just fun creativity um i work with my clients like i said i'm really big on what is fun for my client? What has my client been doing? So if, I've, if I'm working with an ex-basketball player, okay, we about to go to the court and have a basketball workout. So um, just um, fun, innovative, new things. I'm always thinking new um, new and, and fresh. So um, what to expect from me? Um, starting up my group fitness classes. Uh, those I'm really, 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 really excited about so like, um get excited guys yeah. it's like um, look at her face you should get nah, excited <laughs> i'm so excited like just come out and just experience it it's, it's an experience yes my training nice so um and i'm very um with my clients i'm always checking on them and even if they don't text me back like i'm that annoying training like did you work out today work out you need to run or like just yeah i'm kind of annoying and but it's in a good way yeah it's um, like those oh she believes in me so much yeah <laughs> yeah. yeah nice um, so, yeah, expect group fitness classes, expect um, out on the lake workouts. Um, Variety. Yeah, it's going to be all types of stuff. And then also, um, I'm like a Nike ambassador influencer, so I like to pub their events a lot. They nice. host free workouts yes. every week. Yes. You know, they have Run Club, but they also have Nike Training Club and Train Chicago, which is geared towards uh, athletes. Mm-hmm. So um, I always push those things and they have free events where like Great after, events. after the yeah. event, you know, you got food, you got drinks. I mean, they might even have you going to a Cubs game or whatever. But the, like people need to know about that free stuff. I'm all about those free events. Like take advantage of it. Yeah. So it's like find your way to play. It's always something else going on out here. So yeah. definitely take advantage. Hey, guys. So it's playtime. Sylvia, explain the circuit that you're going to take me through today. Um, so I'm going to take you through a cardio kickboxing routine of mine. Uh, just beware that my style adds a little twerking into it. So we're going to be twerking a little bit. Y'all know bit. I can't dance. <laughs> but I'm going to try really hard. 101 ways to play. That's what we're here for, okay? Just have fun with it. And what? Metro booming wants some more dick shit. Shoot a man bad like Ricky, but not sleep. Fit like seven bands on a tricolor pit. All my signs red like a stop, nigga, no pit. Mother purple, nigga, I like fucking Marshall Wall. Ain't a foreign else a day, I was just walking wall. Love my baby mama, love my bitch and Barbie Wall. All red diggy suit on right now, slots and wall. Yeah, 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 yeah. Herka, herka, lee. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shit, herka, herka, lee. Hey 
Hey, it's Siobhia Rivers, personal trainer, group fitness instructor, and life coach. You are tuned in to BeastAtPlay.com.